Last week in Denver's Mile High Stadium, Cleveland quarterback Brian Seip threw a significant touchdown pass to tight end Oscar Rome. It was significant because it was the Browns' eighth touchdown pass of the season, which is one more than they could manage during all of 1975. But the surprisingly strong Denver Broncos would not allow Brian Seip and the Browns any more joyous occasions at their expense. In fact, they held the Browns to an average of just three yards per play. And for the 14th consecutive game, they held their opponents to 17 points or less while scoring or setting up almost as many themselves. Number 10, Denver quarterback Steve Ramsey completed only 10 passes in the game, but two of them were scoring passes. One to nine-year veteran Haven Moses, number 25, and the other to Larry Zonka's old buddy from Wyoming, Jim Kick, number 33. Broncos, the defense is scoring, the offense is scoring, and so are the special teams, whose most special member last week was second-year receiver returner Rick Upchurch, number 80. Returning a punt for a touchdown is quite an accomplishment. Last week, Rick Upchurch did it twice without even being touched. The Broncos are a happy bunch these days, and why not? Even without the retired Charlie Johnson and Floyd Little, Denver has scored 90 points in the last two games, and suddenly the future looks unexpectedly bright for the Broncos.